Welcome to this Windows channel and today in another video where I talk about some of the must-have apps and programs in Windows uh, we'll talk about 7-zip. Now uh, first of all a little background of what is a zip file because a lot of people ask me what's a zip file and they don't understand and um, often in you know Outlook or your Hotmail account what you see when somebody sends you multiple uh, files or pictures you see download as zip and nobody knows what that means well basically um, the zip format has been created for two reasons one because it is a compressor so it can actually make files smaller so when you send them out on the internet they're smaller to send smaller to receive um, also you can take multiple files and zip them into one single file. That's also useful because one of the annoying things about sending emails and attachments or even sending out files via Dropbox for example is the fact that if you have you know 15 pictures that you want to send to someone it's really annoying to have to just take each picture and put them as separate uh, attachments in email or upload 15 different pictures on Dropbox. What you can do is you can zip or compress them into one file and call them, I don't know, pictures. And then you'll have a pictures.zip file. It will contain all the pictures. It's going to be only one attachment or one upload. And the person at the other end will simply unzip it. Now, by default, if the only type of compressing files you have are zip, um, Windows already has a decompressor. It can already uncompress zip files and that's a good thing and this is uh, started I think in Windows XP so if you send a zip file to someone they can open it natively without having any software installed that's good but if you want to create them you'll need a piece of software called 7-zip but there's also something more about 7-zip is the fact that it also can compress and decompress uh, several other types of files and that's why 7-zip is nice it can really uncompress even some weird uh, compressing uh, formats that can be used by different types of computers including including Macs so 7-zip is one of the must-have software if you exchange files all the time if you send files if you receive files all the time uh, this is one of the good pieces of software to have. I'll be posting the link in the description below the video. So once you have it, well, you have this decompressor, but it's automatic. You know, if you have a compressed file and click on it, 7-Zip will be the one that's going to open it. And then you can actually extract it somewhere, uh, move it, copy it, or send it somewhere else. You can, of course, create zipped files and you can either you know use the interface here and add files but uh, you can also use the right click and say for example I want to compress downloads and send this to someone I can right click on a file or a folder click 7-zip and you see here add to download.zip it means that it's gonna compress everything into one big file called download.zip that I can send or upload to Dropbox instead of you know um, downloading all the files uh, one by one or uploading all the files one by one to the web so hope that uh, you enjoy this little piece of software totally free if you enjoy my videos why not subscribe to my channel you'll be informed when your videos are online if you have any comments questions please feel free to ask give us thumbs up if you like our videos helps us in the ratings on YouTube and uh, maybe you have a favorite piece of software that you'd like to share with someone with us basically and we'll share it with everyone why not send me uh, that information in a private message and uh, hopefully you enjoy our videos and we'll come back to our channel